Hello friends, in this video we are going to derive the rate of dado in ceramic tiles. So first of all, let us understand what is dado, where it is used and what is its purpose. When tiles are laid on the lower portion of the wall, then it is called as a dado. Dado is mainly provided in walls of kitchen and bathrooms. It is provided in bathrooms to avoid water absorption in walls. And dado is provided in the kitchen so that the oil and dirt accumulated on tile surface can easily be wiped out. Vitrified tiles, ceramic tiles, glazed tiles are commonly used as dado wall tiles. While selecting tiles for dado, its thickness should be less as it can fall down due to its own weight. Now let us understand how to calculate the rate of ceramic tile in dado. For analysis purpose, we will consider 5 square meter of wall area. First we will calculate cost of ceramic tiles for 5 square meter area. Ceramic tile required for 5 square meter area is equal to 5 square meter. For ceramic tiles, the wastage and breakage factor is 5%. So, 5 into 5% is equal to 0.25 square meter. Ceramic tiles including wastage for 5 square meter area shall be 5 plus 0.25 is equal to 5.25 square meter. Now consider rate of ceramic tile is 45 rupees per square feet. So, total cost of ceramic tile shall be 5.25 into 45 into 10.764 is equal to 2543 rupees. Now we have to derive the cost of white cement. White cement is filled in joints in between the tiles. The quantity of white cement depends on size of tiles. If tile size is less, then more the quantity of white cement and vice versa. White cement cost is very less, so we will not go into that calculation. While laying floor tiles, the joints width is more, but in case of dado, the joint width shall be less to avoid seepage of water. Generally, white cement required for ceramic tiles dado is at the rate of 25 rupees per square meter. So, 5 into 25 is equal to 125 rupees. For dado, cement sand bedding of 12 mm thickness in cement mortar 1s to 3 is used. So, we have to calculate the volume of mortar first. The formula is 5 into 0 0.012 is equal to 0 0.06 cubic meter. Now, we will add 40% for dry to weight volume. 0.06 into 40% is equal to 0 0.02 cubic meter. Now total volume of mortar shall be 0 0.06 plus 0 0.02 is equal to 0 0.08 cubic meter. Now we will calculate the number of cement bags. The formula is 0 0.084 divided by 1 plus 3 is equal to 0 0.02 cubic meter. I have considered 1 plus 3. It is because here the 1 to 3 is the proportion of cement mortar. Hence, cement part shall be 1 plus 3 is equal to 4. The volume of one bag of cement is 0 0.035 cubic meter. Hence, we will divide it by 0 0.035 to convert it into bags. The formula is 0 0.021 divided by 0 0.035 is equal to 0 0.6 bags. We will consider a rate of cement bag 280 rupees. Amount of cement required shall be 0 0.6 into 280 is equal to 168 rupees. Now, we will calculate sand in cubic meter. The formula is 0 0.08 divided by 1 plus 3 into 3 is equal to 0 0.06 cubic meter. Here I have multiplied it with 3 because sand is 3 times the cement in the proportion. We will consider rate of crushed sand that is 3000 rupees per brass means 3000 divided by 2.83 is equal to 1060 rupees per cubic meter. Amount of sand required shall be 0 0.063 into 1060 is equal to 67 rupees. After laying mortar, a cement slurry shall be required over a bed of mortar at the rate of 3.3 .3 kg per square meter. The cost of cement for 1 kg is equal to 250 divided by 50 is equal to 5 rupees. Hence for 5 square meter, the amount of cement slurry required shall be 5 into 5 into 3.3 .3 is equal to 83 rupees. For deriving the total material cost, we have to add cost of ceramic tile, white cement, grey cement, sand and cement slurry that is 2543 plus 250 plus 168 plus 67 plus 83 is equal to 2985 rupees. Now we have to add the cost of transportation, tool stackles and consumables at 5% that is 2985 into 5% is equal to 149 rupees. Now add 1% for safety. 2985 into 1% is equal to 30 rupees. 
Now the subtotal is 2985 plus 149 plus 30 is equal to 3164 rupees. As per current market rate, the labor rate for ceramic tile dado is 20 rupees per square feet. Hence for 5 square meter, the labor cost shall be 5 into 20 into 10.764 is equal to 1076 rupees. Now the subtotal is 3164 plus 1076 is equal to 4241 rupees. Now add 15% for overhead and profit that is 4241 into 15% is equal to 636 rupees. Amount for 5 square meter of ceramic tile dado is 4241 plus 636 is equal to 4877 rupees. Rate per square meter for ceramic tile dado is 4877 divided by 5 is equal to 975 rupees. And per square feet rate for ceramic tile dado shall be 975 divided by 10.764 is equal to 91 rupees. Important note The material rates considered in this rate analysis are exclusive of GST. The material and labor rates may vary depending on site condition, location, and type of project. I have not considered the wastage of cement and sand in mortar. You can consider it as per your convenience. So friends, I hope now you can calculate the rate of TADO. Like this video if you learned something and share it with someone who might benefit from it. If you have any doubts or suggestions, please give your comments. Subscribe to Engineering Motive for more such videos and ring that notification bell so that you won't miss the new video. Finally, thanks for watching.